hello everyone so in this video we are going to see access mod modifiers so what are access modifiers these are keywords used to control the visibility meaning meaning let's say you created one class let's say you created one class pair inside this pair you created this variable int x and int y so these access modifiers are going to define which other class can see these variables that is what access modifiers are visibility which classes which one can access these variables and which one cannot so if you create let's say three classes let's say pair one pair two pair three inside pair one you have two variables x and y then there is one class pair 2 in which you have let's say x1 y1 and a few more classes right now your main function can access these variables or not your main function can access these variables or not do you want the main function to access these variables if you don't so you can change the access modifiers right now you have just written int you can write something like private that we are going to discuss about in this video only if you write private then this x1 cannot be accessed if you have written nothing this is default so this can be accessed up to a certain extent okay so so basically define the visibility of your variables inside a class or a method inside a class right so that is what access modifiers are now what are the access modifiers that we have the first one is private the next one is default the next one is public and the last one is protected so in today's video we are not going to study this protected access modifier because to understand a protected you first need to understand inheritance right so after inheritance we'll see this access modifier as well for this video we are going to focus on private default and public all right okay so so let's create a chart right let's create a chart this is my private this is my default and this is my public now these are, these are my three access modifiers here in column i am going to write the reach possible reach okay possible reach are variables inside same class same within the class variable within the class let's not write inside variables within the class okay i'm going to explain these terms as well don't worry don't worry i'm going to explain these terms as well so so variables within the class is the first column that i'm going to create then the next column that i'm going to create is variable variable across the class but within same package same package same folder within within same folder right and third one is let's not write variable as at all because methods are going to act the same kind of same so within the class let's write within the class across the class but within same package then again don't write variable across classes across class and and let's write across class and across packages okay so these things all right so first let's talk about public within the class within the class meaning let me show you let me show you this is my student class right now if i am talking about public so what i am going to do is i am going to write corresponding to my name public corresponding to my variable name public meaning these two are completely public you talk about method method can be written as public default or private so right now this is public now if they are public no you can access them within the class so is this is public string name 
ओके ओके हाउ अबाउट हाउ अबाउट वी डू नॉट स्टार्ट विथ पब्लिक रादर वी स्टार्ट विथ प्राइवेट दैट विल मेक मोर सेंस टू यू ओके सो दिस इज प्राइवेट सो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू अबाउट प्राइवेट एक्सेस मॉडिफायर्स फर्स्ट सो दिस इज प्राइवेट दिस इज प्राइवेट एज वेल अबाउट फंक्शन विल टॉक अबाउट द फंक्शन फंक्शन विल बिहेव सेम राइट नाउ दैट आई हैव क्रिएटेड प्राइवेट स्ट्रिंग नेम प्राइवेट इंट ईयर ऑफ बर्थ इन साइड दिस क्लास स्टूडेंट यू कैन सी आई कैन एक्सेस ईयर ऑफ बर्थ दैट आई कैन डू राइट नाउ लेट्स गो टू आवर मेन फंक्शन जस्ट फॉर फन देयर यू कैन सी आई हैव दिस स्टूडेंट एस वन क्रिएटेड नो देर इज नो कंस्ट्रक्टर एज सच सी तो I have written this student s1 is equal to new student. Now because the variables are private name and year of birth and this dot java that I am trying to access this main function is inside a different class. See, this is student class. Inside the class you have these two variables. Inside the class you are able to access year of birth. There is no red mark. right so that's what i have written inside within the class within the class private variables can be accessed no worries with that now second column look carefully across the class but within the same package meaning this student is one class then just for fun is another class in which we have a main and both of them are within same package within same folder test2 right both of them are within same package so now both of them are within the same package but across the class now in just for fun if i try to write s1 dot year of birth see marker the field student dot year of birth is not visible within the same package but across the class a private variable of student class is not accessible in just for fun class in the main function of just for fun class right so even though they are within the same package but they are different classes you cannot access a variable that are private all right okay so within the within the same class accessible across the class but within the same package not accessible now last one is across class and across packages meaning meaning let's say this is student dot java and i am trying to create one class in a different in different package test one package let's say i created this client right and in this client i am trying to create student student s1 is equal to new student right now if i write s1 dot year of birth again same funda i cannot access them see this is again again focus on the representation client from client which is in test 1 i am trying to access student class variable that is in test 2 completely different package i am not able to access them so private is actually name itself suggests you no know, private is within the class you can access them within the class now use case you can see you guys if you create private name or private year of birth you cannot access in just for fun but inside this method you can access year of birth and this method is public so if i write s1 dot check no so i will be able to indirectly access your year of birth i can access year of birth so this helps in if you want to just get something see year of birth via this check method i can get year of birth of a student right but i cannot change the year of birth right so let's say you are creating bank account of somebody right so you want to just see the loan interest that is applicable to that can that people that person right so you can access the date, rate of interest via a method but you cannot actually change that variable that's where private keyword is super useful okay, these are hidden you can get but you cannot set you no know, these type of thing you can do using private keywords okay now next one let's look at the next one next one is a default default is a simple you guys default is if you don't write anything no so that is a default if you don't write simply write string name int year of birth 
so this is default access modifier now about default access modifier within the class can we access default modifier default access modifier default keywords yes yes we can you can see name is default year of birth is default and we are able to access year of birth inside this function right inside this method right second thing can we access across the class but within the same package within test 2 my student classes in test 2 so can i in test 2 another java if i go to just for fun inside that can we access so let's see if we can write s1 dot year of birth s1 dot year of birth yes i am able to access s1 dot year of birth what happened with this one okay so s1 of course you want to no maybe print this something you need to do otherwise they will show the red marker so let's say i'm going to print it so see you can actually access s1 dot year of birth same goes for name as well if you want to access you can see here s1 dot name and s1 dot year of birth they are accessible to you right so default if i write across the class but within the same package yes if you are within the same package and across the class you can access those variables and same will be applicable to methods as well last one across the class and across packages let's try that meaning i want to access this name and year of birth from a different package see test one is the package and student is in test right so can i access in can i access in this client student dot year of birth let's try it out so s1 dot see check the method that i am able to access but year of birth there is no year of birth or name that is accessible so you are right exactly if you are using a default no so you cannot access it across the package from one package to another package you cannot access those variables okay now pause this video and try for public you can guess what how public is going to work in these cases right now let's try it out let's try it out let's try to change everything to public this is my student class in the student class let's write public string name name then public int year of birth so if i have initialized i have used this public access modifier first of all can i use within the same class class is student can i use in one of the method of that class right definitely check is the method inside this i am able to use year of birth so if i see if i write within the class within the class public is definitely useful then across across the class but within the same package so just for fun am i able to use s1 dot name s1 dot year of birth absolutely right you are absolutely right see s1 dot name and s1 dot year of birth they are accessible here both of them you can access so let's mark it correct across the class but within same package accessible now last one where both private and default access modifier failed let's try it out there so can i access this name and year of birth of student class which is in test 2 you can see can i access it inside test 1 in my client let's try it now so if i write s1 dot see now name and year of birth yes they are accessible to me in they are accessible to me in different package as well in test one i can access in different package so that is your public access modifier you guys public is basically within a file within a source you are not able to see source by the way let me show you yeah within a source if you have multiple packages no and any variable that are public any variable that is public no you can access it anywhere inside that source across the packages public is visible no name itself suggests as well public you can access it anywhere so here these are the tick cross cross tick tick cross tick 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 this is your access modifier you guys this is what you have to remember about the use cases of public private and default access modifier how to use private write private keyword how to use default don't write anything if you don't write anything just write variable int 
year of birth, string name or anything that is nothing but default access modifier, then you can use public as well for any any packages within a given source. All right. All right, you guys. So I think that's all about these three access modifiers. I will see you in the next video. I hope you understood this. Till then, ta-ta, bye-bye, see ya.